dear students myself shubha chamoli and i will be teaching you science in this academic session as you are aware that during this lockdown period our attempt is to utilize this time to maximum extent so that your studies continue without hindrance in view of this i have shared with you lecture notes videos of chapter 1 matter in our surroundings in continuation i will also be sharing with you videos of some important concepts so without further ado let's start today's discussion so the very first question arises what is matter anything which is around you is matter it can be anything kept near you or anything which can be seen as far up to sky but scientifically we say that matter is anything that occupies space and has mass so now a question arises what do you understand by the term occupies space that is anything which has volume and with mass you mean that anything which has weight anyhow mass and weight are two different terms and we will study about them in detail in chapter 10 gravitation for now you just understand that anything which has weight is mass and it is measured in kilograms so on the basis of physical state matter is classified into solid liquid and gases while matter is classified as pure substance and mixtures on the basis of chemical composition further pure substances can be either elements or compounds example of elements are oxygen hydrogen sodium chloride iron and many more an example of compounds are water sodium chloride etc like in case of compound water there are two atoms of element h and one atom of element o so element h is the element of hydrogen and element o is oxygen now these two atoms of element hydrogen and one atom of element oxygen combine together to form compound water one molecule of compound water now mixtures can be homogeneous mixtures or heterogeneous mixtures a homogeneous mixture has uniform composition throughout so what do you understand by uniform composition it means that you cannot identify the individual parts of this mixture like for example the soft drinks the lemonade you drink or even water is also an example of homogeneous mixture like here i am giving you an example of lemonade that is shikanji jo hum log peete hain to can you identify that where sugar is where salt is where the drops of lemon are and where water is no you cannot identify the individual parts of the mixture by seeing it isn't it now comes heterogeneous mixture in heterogeneous mixture the substances do not blend smoothly as it was in homogeneous mixture that is here the individual substances can be seen they can be detected for example you can say like in your childhood you must have played with mud <coughs> if you take some muddy water and put it into a jar and leave it for some time you will observe later that the dirt settles down at the bottom of the jar and water comes at the top the muddy water is an example of heterogeneous mixture of soil and 
water in which the two individual substances or components that is water and soil can be observed well dear students we will be discussing about elements compounds types of mixture in detail in chapter number 2 i will pause here for today and will be discussing particulate nature of matter tomorrow so stay safe stay at home and start studying thank you